A and B started the business. A capital is 600 more than B. After after months, after how many months? After months, B withdraws half of his capital. If the total profit is earned by A and B in the year is 13,600, out of which A, A shares rupees 8,000, what is A's investment? First of all, the language is not correct. I mean, I don't know where you have picked this question from, but it's not framed nicely. I mean, I can understand the meaning of the question, but a lot of errors there. And moreover, you have not given us this value after how many months? Amit, are you there in the session? Oh, I think Amit is the one who had mentioned, right? That I had posted one question on partnership. And this is also partnership, yeah. I had posted one question on partnership. Nobody responded. Amit was disappointed. But Amit, see, your question has come, but it's incomplete. You have mentioned A and B started the business. A's capital is 600 more than B's capital. After some months, B withdraws half of his capital. If the total profit is earned by A and B, is 13,600 in which A's share is 8,000, what is A's investment? Yeah, Chandan has also mentioned the same thing, that Amit Negi is present here, he was asking for the same question in the session. But Amit, answer cannot be determined in the given case, because the value is missing. Amit, what do we do? Sorry. Yeah, so this is what you have to do, Amit, and you get the answer. What is A's investment? B plus 600. That is the answer. So you have to solve for B. Basically, this equation you have to solve for B. But in this current scenario, you cannot solve because after how many months B withdraws half of his capital is not given. Depending on that, you have to fill question mark and question mark here. I mean, I don't mean to say that the same question mark will come in both the places. This will be question mark, this will be 12 minus question mark. Let me just put it neatly otherwise. If let's say this is X months, you have to say, let me just do this. This would be B into X plus b by 2 into 12 minus x do this and you get the answer amit so find out what is x substitute here let me explain what happens here 8000 rupees is the share of a remaining 5600 out of 13600 if 8000 is for a remaining 5600 is for b so 8000 by 5600 let's assume b has invested b what will be A's investment? A has invested 600 more than B. So B plus 600. For how many months? 12 months. Now look at what happens in case of B. After X months, B withdraws half of his capital. So B invested B rupees only for X months. For the first X months. After that, half of the capital was removed. Which means only second half is left. Out of B, if half is removed, what is remaining? The other half is remaining. So from B, B by 2 is removed. So remaining is B by 2. This B by 2 is there in the business for how many months? 12 minus X months. In the first four months, let's say x equals to 4. In the first four months, the investment is b. In the last eight months, the investment is b by 2. Let's say x equals to 7. In the first seven months, investment is b. In the last five months, investment is b by 2. So x will be given in the question. Substitute that. Solve for b. Use this equation to solve for b. And then you can find out what is a's investment. A's investment is b plus 600. Here you have to solve for B. Right? Technically it's only one equation with one unknown. So you can do that. 